Is it just me? Or was the first day of the indoor season a bit underwhelming? I did not see some of the big names compete at all, and for the ones who did, they did not compete in their more popular events. Let's take the NCAA for example. Terence Jones was one person who did compete in his event. However, he came fifth in the 60 meters finals, running 6.61 seconds, despite having a 6.46 seconds personal best from last season, which is the season that he won the NCAA 60 meters indoor title. Now, how do you come from being the best to performing so substandardly in arguably your best event? There could be a multitude of reasons. For example, injuries, coaches' instructions, and even something mental, for example. He wasn't feeling good on the day. My theory is that both him and his coach have decided to make the Olympics be his main goal because he did look heavy. If you watch the race, you can see he was looking sluggish coming out the blocks. And from that angle, he did seem to as running back in the last 10 or 15 meters. With that in mind, it could be argued that he's saving his best for later on in the season, and this race was just to ensure he does not have a bulk of competition rust when it comes time for him to deliver on track and field's biggest stage. This theory would then set him up to be a threat to the Olympic title. In that case, I would just be giving him the benefit of the doubt. Let's do the opposite. Another theory would be that he has been complacent and is now well behind in his training and his overall progression. How could one open up their season with 6.46 seconds last season, with 6.54 seconds being his slowest time, but still only manage to run 6.61 and wasn't even able to play second, he came fifth? Whatever the case may be, it begs to question how will the season progress for him and other athletes? Or is it just that I'm coming off a high from last season, where records seem to have been breaking week after week? Or maybe it's just too early to tell. At the end of the day, we just have to hope for the best for our sport and pray our athletes do what they do best and put on a show for us to enjoy. Until next time, Tracklytics out.